All right, guys, welcome back to more Super Mario RPG, the Seven Stages Extended Edition. I should have said Super Luigi RPG, <laughs> but anyways, look at this! All these hidden items with just Luigi. What is this? Anyways, I got my timer started on my cell phone, so I might, so I can know what uh. Okay, special firing pan. So that's one of the items. So that I know, so I can keep track of what, how much time I'm recording. Uh, okay. Found a golden cone. All right. So I think this dark boo is basically setting this up so we can fight Luigi. We're watching you, Greeny. Okay, be like that then. What? Are you trying to steal my other stuff too? Leave me be. A tale for the ages. Can the undermined man prove his fellow person's innocence and thus rise to high glory himself? If and until you guys prove you're innocent, I wouldn't eat the food I served if I were you. Better act quick if you want to see your buddy come out of there as a free man. Found engagement ring. Now go talk to the guard by the employees only door. Although the evidence seems stacked against you two, I still believe that you two might be telling the truth. Well, thank you. At least one person believes us. What? You retrieved the four items. Um, so now we will have a trial, I guess. Oh, snap. Judge Judy in his... No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> 1, 11 p.m. Your Honor, if the defendant has no defender to defend his case, then this def case should be defeated with no defense. Judge T, I'm not exactly sure what you just said, but if it had anything to do with this case not being played out, you're in the wrong. You guys woke me up in the middle of my three day now, so if there is a dispute, it will be solved. True enough, true enough. But we have been waiting for waiting a while now. Maybe the defense got scared. Mia scared? This may just be a true adversary. Boy Luigi, look at him. He up in that black. He got his hand. He look like he got his hands up in his pocket, looking like the mafia. Looking like he came straight out from the mafia, guys. The mafia. You're late. Or he's just up for a funeral. Objection. <coughs> On what grounds? <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Your clock is uh, six minutes fast. I still had an extra minute to make it. Why, that's preposterous! It's 1.35 p.m. 1.29 p.m. Ah! <laughs> Luigi busted that behind, son! Impossible! The Moonwalk! Oh, Luigi Moonwalker! Oh, Super Smash Brothers Melee style! Desist with that Inferno Celebration dance. The trial hasn't been even begun yet. <laughs> if you two are done, can we now start the trial? That's hilarious. <laughs> Luigi busted his tail, son. Okay, 2 or 3 p.m. to trial. This is this is this game is super fun. So far and funny. Prosecution, what do you have to say? My point is very easy and clear. 
Enlighten us. Look at the clothes he's wearing. Are those clothes not the clothes of somebody who would steal? What the hell, dude? A very good point. They always say to judge to judge a mushroom based solely on its outward appearance, I believe. Hmm. Defense, do you have a response? Hmm. hmm. You're completely right. It's a what 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 uh, 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 uh. what I gotta pick answers from this? Oh man, not your completely. It's a fashion statement. You guys forced him to wear that. I want to say that right there, son. It's a fashion statement. I like one of these two. It's a fashion statement. You guys forced him to wear that. So you actually gotta pay attention to this. Wow, I like that. I want to say it's a fashion statement, but I'm gonna put you guys forced him to wear that. Seriously, yes, that's what I'm gonna say. Good golly, he's right. He had no choice in what he's wearing right now. That is a non applicable statement. Great response. All right, then, prosecution, what is your next point? Okay, Your Honor, we are already upstanding. We are all upstanding gentlemen, wouldn't you say? By the tip of my beard, I would have to agree with you. Where are you going with this? Here, there, anywhere. I just have a point to make. If that man was an upstanding gentleman, would he really sport such ugly facial hair? Clean shaven is what modern people have. What the heck? Mario's always been like that. Okay, you're right. I can't believe how undeniably ugly facial hair is. Suited for a thief, I see. Defense, do you have a response? Yes. You're listening to a turtle? <laughs> that is so funny. You have facial hair too, Honor. Yes! We gotta put that. We gotta put that. Good heavens, you're right! <laughs> if I have it, facial hair is actually beautiful. Great response. That is so funny. <laughs> ah, this game is hilarious. Continue on this bus wreck. <laughs> Next point. Prosecution. We've all heard about people wearing different masks, correct? Different ones reflect a person's personality. It can be a mood. My wife tells me that all the time. I have no idea what she's talking about. Let's examine this man, shall we? Talking about having different masks, this man is completely makeshift. Let me just name a few of, of the strange things he's doing things he does also guys if you hear some in the background that's the uh, blinds in the room I'm in uh, for the window so yeah sorry about that plumbing tennis racing referee teacher party thrower dancer singer the list goes on and on on people Mario's famous duh so he's a man with many hobbies and jobs I'm not sure where you're trying to lead us Rest assured that I w won't be doing any leading. It's too obvious. Wouldn't having all those jobs and hobbies be a perfect cover-up? A perfect cover-up to steal items? I saw it coming this time, too. Why else would you have so many hobbies to cover up your real hobbies? Stealing? Defense, do you have a response? Oh. Hmm. Many hobbies mean well-rounded. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, damn. I want to say many hobbies mean mean well-rounded. Because Mario is definitely a well-rounded person. Like, every, like in the fighting games, tennis, in his tennis games, Mario's a balanced person. So, yeah. Plumbing business equals down the drain. Down the drain. Down the drain. Down the drain. I'm thinking about the uh, Outlast video game. It's a social statement. There we go. That's an even better way of viewing it. It's not to cover personal faults, it's to broaden horizons. Great response. There we go. This is the last point, prosecution. You go. Your Honor, it's a hard knock life, ain't it? Love isn't always in the air. Broken hearts are all around us. I know exactly what you mean. Wait, I'm married to my first girlfriend. This doesn't apply to me at all. <laughs> okay. Just imagine a little bit, okay? Sure. Anyway, this is 
quite a clear point. No extra elaboration will be necessary. Everyone knows about this man and his relationship with the princess. Oh yeah, I read about it every day in Mushroom Kingdom Gossip Daily. You're no stranger either, Dan. I want to raise a few points about the unethicalness of it all. Go on. I mean, what is the age difference between these two, first of all? Are they ever going to get married or keep in the shadows? Hmm. Mario's like, hmm. Never thought about that. <laughs> That was last week's issue title. Go on. I'm raising key ethical concepts here. A man who shows such low values and morals to a princess could easily steal some stuff, right? What? What are you talking about? No. You're right. That is nasty, not morally sound. And someone like him could easily steal a few measly items. My case is taking a risk. That's how you say it right. Defense, do you have a response? I... He's... Yes, there we go. He saves us from Bowser Daily. Oh, yeah, I forgot. This is Mario. We're talking about... Great response. Okay, all the prosecuting is finished. We will now take a short recess while I reach my decision. Alright, that was pretty fun. That took about nine minutes doing all that. Five, 5.46 p.m. the decision. My decision is that Mario is found not guilty. There was not enough conclusive evidence against this man. The defense did well in showing that. Uh, so, I want to know, I wonder what would happen if you got the answers wrong. Like, just picked them by mistake. I'm guessing that uh, you might get a game over or something. I don't know. Or you'd have to find a way to break out. Or prove that you're innocent or something. Well, you were the better lawyer today, my good friend. My apologies about trying to get your partner locked up for life. You deserve, you deserve the right to do a victory dance. <laughs> Luigi's so silly, man. But he is definitely my favorite Mario, brother. 11.14 p.m. Oh wow. Okay, so we're back controlling Mario. Everything's good. Or at least the conductor guy believed me, so let's talk to him for a second. I knew you two were innocent. Have a good night's sleep. Well, alright! Uh oh. No, I didn't actually hear anything. Okay. I thought I was gonna have to uh, stop my recording for a second, guys, but uh, we're good. That was nice. Alright. I guess you guys were innocent after all. Sleep well. You damn right I was innocent. Come and wake me out of my sleep. <laughs> uh oh, there's that there's that boo again. These jerks completely messed up my messed my plan up. There's no fun in hiding things if they get found so soon. Now I'm going to give them the scare of their lives. Uh oh. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> that was completely worth it. You should see the look on your face. Well now, it's gone. The name's Boogly Boo. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Now if you'll excuse me, I have a bus to hunt. Go after the boo. Well, okay, day... Hey, 6 or 1 in the morning. Wow. So, Mario and Luigi got about 7 hours of sleep. Well, almost seven hours of sleep. 
because it was like 11, wait, 11, 14 when they went to bed. Probably a little bit more than that, but I don't know. They're almost seven hours. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this part of Super Mario RPG The Seven Sages. That was about 15 minutes, and uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. If not, then I'll see you guys tomorrow, maybe. Hopefully. But uh, yeah. Uh, don't forget to leave a like and a comment, and uh, yeah, even subscribe if you enjoy the series. But anyways, thanks for watching. Peace out, Rayquaza Clan, and I'll see you another time.